Peace family, so it's been reported this morning in the news that Sasha Johnson, a black equal rights activist from the UK, has been critically shot in the head in South London. So definitely um, crazy news, we want to say thoughts and prayers out to Sasha. Um, it says Sasha Johnson, 27, was one of the organizers of the first ever million people march to protest against systemic racism in the UK. We're no longer looking at just one incident. We're looking at the systemic structure that means that those incidents happen. So it's not just George Floyd died because we've lost many black people and the UK disassociates from racism. But we have to remember the Windrush generation came here when we're funding war to bomb other countries and people are coming here for safety and rest. Then we're fleeing them away with our xenophobia. So we're not disassociating from it. We're saying yes is here. And we need to address it now. We're in 2020. We've come too far for racism to still be a problem. So this was some words from Sasha last year. Well, let's see if we can find any information on this. It just says police were appealing for information where she was found with life-threatening injuries in Southwark at about 3 a.m. on Sunday morning. So in a statement on its Facebook page, the talking, the taking the initiative party, I'm sorry, a new political group she's a part of said that it's with sadness that she's sustained such injuries. Now, this was something brought to my attention on Instagram and stuff too. So um, it's definitely going around. And I mean, what do you guys think of this? I mean, we hear a lot of stuff like this in the US. Now we're seeing shades of it in the UK. Now we can't speculate until the going on to the situation of what's actually happened. We're trying to find out some more. We will report as it comes in. And it says Sasha has been actively fighting for black people and injustices that surround the black community, as well as being both a member of BLM and a member of taking the Initiative Party's Executive Leadership Committee. So here we see um, Sasha here. We we'll start with a member of the nation. And uh, but definitely a sad situation. Um, trying to find out some more about this. And we we'll see uh, some older clips. She's been in the news quite a bit. Says so we've come too far for racism to still be a problem. But it's being heavily reported on all media sources. It says it is believed that she had been at a party when she was shot. So um, we don't know the full details of what's going on. Just know that they were appealing for information. So we just said she had been at a party or a gathering when she was injured but they said they do not believe she was the intended victim. It says, as far as I'm aware, this incident is more related to rival gangs as opposed to her activism. So it would be such a shame, you know, um, something to come out as such. Police said there was currently no evidence to suggest it was a targeted shooting. People are saying, pray for Sasha. You can go around on Instagram, Twitter, you know, that we see um, people raising awareness where they can. So thoughts and prayers, let us know your thoughts in the comments and uh, peace to Sasha Johnson. Hopefully she make it through. Peace family, don't forget to like, share and subscribe and check us out on bout.online.com. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook for exclusive playlists and social media for all different types of segments and content.